What's up, Mananap? Okay, so welcome back, uh, mga kamananap. Uh, so this time, I'm going to continue with ADT link list. So, so far, what we have right here, or in what we have actually done, done we have already operations like this empty add at first. We were also able to do traversal and then add at last and add at position and even doing uh, determining the current size of our link list. So now this time, let's perform a delete at first uh, operation. So delete at first operation. So we have here delete at first. So all we just need to do is you can either uh, define it as boolean. It, uh, if the deletion is successful, it, it can return like it will return true or false. It can be void. It depends on you. Like uh, of course you can always have like string or you can you want it to have void. So any will do. Okay. So let's say public void. Let's say delete or remove. Remove. Uh, since add, add man can also delete, delete at first. Oops, first. Okay, so delete at first. So, of course, the for us to, I mean, we are going to use as usual, uh, we going, we are going to test the our node if it's empty because if it is, then therefore we have to display something like our node or list is actually empty okay but if this is like a string of course you can always do something like return return something like that return that list is empty and then it requires another else return something okay but this time let's make use of void okay and then let's have here else so all we just need to do for the add the uh, deletion of a node at, uh, at the beginning, you just have to define uh, the link so so that we are not going to break the chain. No? That links between each node will have to assign first a link as the head, and then after that we can do something like link that link that next so meaning to say what have what we have right here is that uh, the the link has the address of the head okay and then after that the node that for uh, the node the next node that point that is pointed by our by that node which is the first node will now be assigned as the new head so meaning to say the node comes after to it will now become the head, okay? And it gets the the address of the head. So making it that the first making the first node has uh, already deleted or something like it's already it's already eradicated. It's already done. It's gone rather. Okay. So let's have it. Uh, let's have it tested here. So let's say ll dot delete at first okay so if it returns a value then you will have to put it in a system that out that print line for you to know if it's uh, successful or not or you can actually put here uh six so delete at first so so far our nodes has three five seven so we can have three uh we expect to delete three so we just hope to yeah, so therefore, 3 is now deleted. So the remaining list are now 5, seven, uh, nodes are now 5, 7, 12, and 15. So you can also put something like here as like uh, uh, deletion first node was deleted successfully. Successfully. Is that correct? Yeah. So yeah, and then you run the program, and then their first node was deleted successfully. You can also do like as what I'm saying earlier. You can have like string. So this should be like return 
and then this is like return okay and then of course it will not uh it will not be going to display that deletion is uh i mean deletion is successful but you have to make it like uh put it in a and then so it depends upon uh it depends on you now so it's your discretion it's your prerogative whether uh what would what you would like to what would you what you would like in your program to be like if you do that a like this or the er earlier program then it's up to you it's your it's it's again uh, you have the autonomy to do that so kanya kanyang criteria okay yeah so i guess that would be all for the deletion delete uh, deleting at the beginning see you guys in my next